Hello everyone, welcome back to Mitch Games, Knuckleheads, and we are here with another episode of Red Trigger. As always, um, I do have to put the caveat in the beginning, if you don't want to see any spoilers to this game, this game is still not out, it's still on Steam Greenlight, please go vote for it. But if you don't want to see the game, or you don't want to see any of the gameplay, stop right now, wait for the game to come out, it shouldn't be too much longer. Now, this is where I left off last time, and we are going to figure out how to turn this thing oh you know what I forgot the reason why this is so long is so you can go on the backside and do this derp -a derp -a derp -a derp -a derp so you can reach it from the backside there we go that works so um this game, I've been really so far at least enjoying it because it's a kind of a unique game in and of itself. It's not something that, uh, how's the word I would put it? It's not something I've seen done a lot. Uh, you got tons of different puzzle type of games, but this game just kind of, ooh, firewall. Oh, hello, new area. Uh, this game is kind of unique in the sense that it does things differently. Let's see what we got. Doors. Do those things go away? No, they're not. Sweet. Okay, so. Oop. Let's see here. Shoot that. Now keep the door open. Okay, so there's probably gotta be some tricks to do this. Okay, so that's door one. So once we're through, we can get rid of that. Okay, boink. And we're done there. Take that out, and there we go. So, it's unique, it's a it's a shooter puzzle. Um, it's kind of like in that realm of like, uh, Portal in that sense. It's, it's very um, unique. I wouldn't say different, but unique. Um, Hmm. Oh, sweet. Okay. Oh, uh, come on, control. There we go. Um. In this game, I. It, it's it's. It's interesting because, um, reading up some more on the uh, bio about the game. It's unique in the fact that it's not using a human protagonist, which is a lot of games tend to do. Oops. Whoop. Ah, okay, I tried to do something funny. Not really. But it's using a robotic protagonist, obviously you can see his hands. There we go. And so you, you get that feeling, okay, it's not superhuman like. What the hell just happened? Okay. That was weird. Hmm. I, I gotta know what I hit, I wonder. That's kind of interesting. But, uh... It's got some unique factors to it, which is kind of nice. And... I think this is a game that... I believe if it were to be sold at $10, it could do extremely well. A $10 puzzle game that's fun. Um... Would I say more than that? Maybe, maybe not. Um, the guy who does create the game, though, uh, is trying is going to give it away for free, I believe. Don't quote me on that. But like this right here, this is like if you don't look at it from this angle, you don't know that what you need to hit. And I've actually had to um, 
played this a couple times. I've had several bad recordings of this game. Not not the game's fault. This is actually my fault. The uh, software I was using didn't want to work. So, um, this is my second or third time doing this. So, huh? Okay. So I kind of know a little bit of how to do this now, and I'm kind of more or less doing a better talking at it than um, games I didn't have like previous experience with. Um, this is fun. We. Um, it kind of feels like Willy Wonka a bit. It's like, um, the game is still kind of glitchy. Um, I, I gotta wonder if it's a render issue. Like, if it's something that's just not rendering correctly. Because it just seems like there's a lot to render, despite the fact that there's not a lot of detail. Um, but it'll be interesting to see how it plays out. Um, but there's some locks on this one. And you turn around and you hit this button, and bada boom, everything else falls off. And it goes into the abyss of the sky. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of what like freaked me out a bit. Like, I was like, "Ooh, that's a drop." And even my stomach, just right there, like, got a little queasy from the drop. Look. So, green button's a new thing. That's kind of cool. Oh, cool. Okay. So this one is a very, what I would call, tricky jump. You almost gotta run it at the same time. Ah. So it's, it's, I've died this multiple times just because it's such a hard jump to make. I wouldn't say it's difficult, it's just hard. And shift. Whoop. Yeah, see, it's just, it's, it's just a weird, weird jump. You can do it, it's not hard, it's just... I wonder if I'm not gonna run... Nope. I, I hit the wall on the way down. Let's see here. Oh, I made it, finally. It is such a weird jump. It is such a weird jump. Okay, so the next part of this puzzle, um, this is by accident, I, since I've had so many bad recordings, I can kind of explain this now, is um, finding where, what lasers can go turn on and off, and these are timed platforms, basically. So I hit this, see the color kind of go away, fade, and it'll turn off, basically. I just shut it off there, but, so you gotta find where to go and how to kind of get over there. This is how you get about to the middle. Um, it's basically jumping from that platform, that one to that one. Um, you don't have to worry about the lasers as much. Um, that one and that one will shut this off. And then you can jump on this one. Whoop, there you go. And there you go. So that's how you kind of do that. And then you should open those two and you're in. Now this is really kind of quite interesting because this is the part where I've gotten stuck both times, even with my bad recording. So I want to see if I can get this figured out. But it's jumping across all these platforms. Seems kind of simple, right? Uh, not, not really. No, no. It's a lot more difficult than you think, and it's sky-based, so it's kind of like, um, I get tad queasy at times. Oh, hello, glitchy time. So, and it's, it, it's kind of a trick because, woo, some of them get, get a little interesting. So, what you gotta do is shoot these. Shoot, I ran out of energy. Huh. And then you gotta kinda run. And you gotta hit these platforms, but I have had so many struggles trying to hit that platform correctly. Um
Oh, I got it. Oh my god, I can't believe I actually hit that. That's that's a miracle I've got. I've gotten farther than this before once, but I've still gotten stuck. So, it's... It's interesting that... If we can get a cross... And then... Oh, no. That, that was timed a lot differently. And... This is the part I would say there's there's a, the the puzzle curve is just right, but the difficulty is a little too much. Cause now I gotta. Sh okay. And see like that right there. I just I don't know if there's a way to kind of I would say just make the platforms a tad bit thicker. That's all they need to be. And nope, and the time the platform's thicker. The timing needs to be better. I I've had so many struggles on this this part. It's not even funny. And every time I've gotten to this point, it's been a little bit of almost sigh of regret. Like I can't believe I got this far. I'm gonna like bang my head in the freaking wall type of deal. Oh, okay. Huh. And it's, it's 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 a little like instant regret type of deal. Oh, like I don't know. I really don't know how I can do this. Like I I got lucky that like doing that last little bit I got lucky. At this point I'm just going. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't. <laughs> Like, two, three, four, five. So I'm assuming I got five on the other one. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. F Whoa, that is not the same timing. I, I definitely am going to track that one. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Wow, ten Oops. seconds to get across is not. That is either four and a half, or that's like. One, two, three, four, five. Oh my god, Oops. I need more time than five seconds. That gets to be a little too much. Cause I gotta get. I, I need more than five seconds. I just that's not. You, five seconds is a really slim margin on the jumps here. Oh god! If I reshoot it, I can. Oh. If I reshoot it, I can kind of get it. But I can't reshoot this one because I need to get going. Oh, I got it. Oh my god, I got it. Oh man. Oh my god. I can't believe I got it. That is not even funny. Like. I, I I got it so wow alrighty um holy holy shit balls okay I will leave it here um, I will do another recording right after this one so I can do back to back episodes on this but thank you guys for watching if you liked the video give it a like if you uh, want to see more great unique videos like this um, subscribe today and I'll definitely give you more great videos just like this um, holy shit, I can't believe I just made that. <laughs> I have tried for like an hour getting past that one spot, and I am just... As always, guys, keep on gaming, keep on having fun, and let's play.